Good morning, everybody. Captain Jim Palmer here, the Dream Business Coach, coming to you once again from a very sunny bridge of my floating home, and uh, was just checking in with uh, our kids, who three of them are still in the Philadelphia area, and um, one of them lives in Rhode Island, Jessica, and um, yeah, it looks like they might get clobbered again with more snow, like a ton of snow. Good morning, Lisa. Lindsay Anderson. Oh, I'm so glad to see Lindsay Anderson. Gosh, it must be like uh, 5.15 or something like that. Lindsay, I'm so glad you're on here. I won't bring you on because I know it's 5 o'clock and you're probably in your jammies. Um, but one of the reasons I'm coming on here before I loop back into my uh, my personal mind here is that tonight at 6 p.m. in the Build Your Dream Business Now Facebook group, we are doing um, free training Tuesday. God, that sun is bright. I can hardly see everybody. Good morning. Yes, it is 5 a.m. <laughs> Good morning, Anita. And one of the th and Lindsay, one click, Lindsay Anderson is going to be my special guest. I had to beg and borrow and steal and send her all kinds of money and gifts, but <laughs> Lindsay is coming back on uh, free training Tuesday. And I got to tell you, there there are so many people out there doing. You know, Facebook, SBO, SBO, SEO, maybe they're doing SBO, SEO and pay-per-click and I mean, just really web, website, online marketing people. But Lindsay, one click Lindsay Anderson is at the top of the heap, in my opinion. I've been doing this an awful long time. And uh, good morning, Eddie. And um, so I am, I, I got to tell you folks, I'm so blessed to have her on my team and she builds my website. She does all, you know, just about all of my marketing online and she's super smart super savvy. I thought yesterday I reached out to her saying, have you heard of this? She goes, yes, Jim Palmer, I heard of that a month ago. <laughs> so she is on the cutting edge of everything. Anyway, Lindsay Anderson is coming on and I'm going to interview her about, um, I think I gave it a pretty cool title, Ninja Facebook Marketing Strategies. Basically, I'm going to ask her to share some of the good stuff she's doing for me. Um, I also hook her up with most of my VIP clients, most of my VIP um coaching clients, um, courtesy of moi and, and their investment they make with me, get a website, they get a landing page, they get their website SEO, they get their Facebook marketing done. We do all kinds of things. And my go-to person to have that done for my top clients is Lindsay. Now, one of the things that Lindsay is going to share tonight is how you can spy on your competitors. What are your competitors doing on Facebook? You know, not every competitor is worth spying on, but it is worth knowing what some are doing. And, and here's the thing. If there's somebody who you believe is doing well and they're doing a lot of marketing, and I don't mean marketing for a week and then turning it off. I mean perpetually spending money, perpetually investing in the growth of their business, and you see the ads don't change much. That could mean one of two things. Either they're, they're not real savvy because they're not checking things out. Good morning, John. And or, and if they've been doing it a long time, which means they have, um, they have the goods to invest, if they've been doing it a long time, it means they're getting results. Those are the people you might want to spy on just to see what they're doing. Lindsay's got a way to know not only what they're doing, how the people, what kind of traffic they're getting, what kind of um, uh, AdWords, and, and ah, now I'm showing my own online ignorance a little bit, but she's going to bring back, she's going to bring the goods tonight at 6 p.m. I have not had breakfast yet, so that's why I'm a little... Um, Sounding a little loopy, but got a really busy day. Coaching calls. I got a great um, Dream Business Mastermind. One of our group calls we do with uh, my paid coaching members at one o'clock. That usually goes about three hours, and then um, at six o'clock we're going to do Free Training Tuesday. Now, Free Training Tuesday. You're watching this on my profile page. That happens in my Build Your Dream Business Now Facebook group. We are at 350 members, which just astounds me. I mean, it's really humbling, but we have so many entrepreneurs and small business owners that are part of this group and people sharing and um, promotion Wednesday is, an, is a place you get to share who you are what you're doing share your website your fan page etc we have big goal Monday free training Tuesday we got some other things going on but you have a lot of access to me in the group you got a lot of access to some very smart people so join that if you're in Facebook just put in uh, build your dream business now or you can use my handy URL which is dreambizgroup.com, dreambizgroup.com. Again, one-click Lindsay Anderson, my special guest for this week's Free Training Tuesday, and that is happening at 6 p.m. Eastern Time in the Build Your Dream Business Now Facebook group. Now, last week, I did a training 
Um, the top 10 mistakes that keep entrepreneurs broke. And man, I got so many behind the scenes messages and questions and things like that. Um, by the way, when you do that, there's absolutely nothing wrong with reaching out. I'm not saying that, but it reminds me of when I was a kid in school and I was a C student at best. When I was a kid in school and, and, and teacher was teaching something and I didn't understand, I'm telling you, I did not raise my hand because I didn't want to in front of everybody not know what I was doing. That's why, by the way, if somebody reaches out to you and they don't post it publicly or do something like that, but they reach out to you privately, that may be a, a there's a, just a little bit of a telltale sign there. So it's a little, oop, just going to share a little, little uh, profit bomb with you there. So the people that are reaching out, um, they, they shared, uh, I heard comments when I released my book, Decide. One of them, I got probably a dozen e private emails. They all had the same type of uh, message. It said, Jim, I know you wrote this book for me. I hate you, but thank you. <laughs> because I called people out and these top 10 reasons really hit home. And uh, so I've shared that. I've shared five of the top 10. Somewhere in my newsfeed below, if you check, you'll see five of the top 10 reasons. So you can see five of them publicly and then if you want to see the whole thing just go to the build your dream business now facebook group but one of them really resonated caught people a little off guard and i called it um what did i call it oh i called it uh free traffic mentality looking for paid traffic results for the free free traffic mentality and what that means it's not but it obviously when you think of traffic it's online traffic and and that's kind of the the 10,000 foot view, but it really has to do a lot with different parts of your business. Now, at the core, if you're expecting to get paid traffic results, let's say you really want to get, <clears throat> is that David, that's David Brown, horrible reflection, good morning. So if you're trying to get a lot of traffic to your website, yet you're only doing free online marketing, so you're posting to your blog, you're posting to social media, you're sharing, you're caring, you're blogging, you're doing all this different stuff, but you're not spending any money to drive traffic to your drive um, the images to in front of your target customers, and then you complain about how slow your growth is, or I only got you know ten people or a hundred people to my website this month. How come I'm not getting five times that? There's a real clue there, and I don't mean to be uh, harsh on this, but you can't get paid traffic results with a free traffic mentality, and that carries into other parts of the business as well, and. Um, <clears throat> You know, if, if you, most entrepreneurs know what a mastermind is, they know the benefits of being in them, but then people that don't want to invest in, or in an actual mastermind that has a coach or a leader as the, as, the, as the lead, but they'll get together with their entrepreneurial friends at Panera Bread once a month. Well, that's okay. I mean, it's actually better than nothing because you get together, but if you're not investing and you're just meeting with people and sharing results, there's nobody that's holding you accountable and and things like that. That's another example of trying to get the benefits, the paid traffic benefits of being in a real mastermind, working with a real seasoned coach, but not investing in yourself. Big growth only happens when you invest in yourself. Do you know that when I put on a Dream Business Academy, my events are not large. I, I run boutique type events compared to some of the others. Um, <clears throat> some of the other folks that get a thousand or two or three thousand people, I, I generally have 50 or, or maybe 60 people at my events. It still costs about, well, my probably my biggest one was uh, Orlando, and that cost me 30 grand. Somebody's saying, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Um, some, so that cost me 30 grand to put that on. Now, if I was trying to do a free event where I just rented a small room, and I just posted on social media, and I got three or four people there, and then I'm wondering how come there's not 50 or 60 people there, yet I'm only, I'm not investing in, in buying you know, traffic and, and doing all the different marketing I need to do and renting a venue and, and the PA system and the food and the drink and all of that to make it a special event that people want to come to, it would be so wrong of me to expect that I'm going to get a lot of people there if I don't invest. So, you know, this uh, paid traffic results with free, tra free traffic mentality says a lot about probably where you are now, if you want to think of it that way, but it also going to speak a lot to where you're going to be a year from now if you don't change that, if you're in the free traffic mentality. So anyway, that was part of, uh, I forget which, no which number that was, but that was one of uh, 10 mistakes entrepreneurs are making to, to uh, that keep themselves broke. So you want to check that out. It's really, really very powerful. And then um, be part of the Build Your Dream Business Now Facebook group at dreambizgroup, dreambizgroup Dot com. I think that's it. Yep. Just want to remind you about free training Tuesday tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern Time. 
with the great and awesome and powerful one-click Lindsay Anderson. My name is Captain Jim Palmer. I'm the Dream Business Coach. I'm really committed to helping you build a more profitable business faster. Hope you have a wonderful and awesome day. Take care, everybody.